Hey everybody, welcome to Ready, Set, Drone. Uh, today I have a charger for the Phantom 4 and the Phantom 4 Pro. It's called the YX-CO2 and it will allow you to charge three Phantom 4 or Phantom 4 Pro batteries at the same time as, long as, as well as the um, remote control. So stay tuned and we'll check it out. All right, so if you noticed, um, I've done two videos right in a row. One was for the DJI Mavic Pro uh, battery charger, aftermarket battery charger. This is the Phantom 4 aftermarket battery charger. The big difference between this and the one that comes with the Phantom 4, just like the Mavic, is that it will charge three batteries at the same time. It has three cables here uh, that allow you to do multiple charges um, right here, you can see, as well as charge the remote um, all at the same time. It is a balanced charger. It has overcharge protection, it has overheat project protection. Um, it's um, metal, it's fairly heavy, and it does have a fan in it, so you can definitely hear the fan kick on when you start to charge. So what I'm gonna do here is, similar to what I did for my uh, Mavic charger test, I've got four batteries. Uh, two of them are actually Phantom 4 Pro and two of them are Phantom 4 batteries. I'm going to take these batteries and I'm going to, yeah, the white ones are the uh, Pro batteries, which are slightly higher milliamp hour, and the gray ones are the Phantom 4 batteries. Okay, so these batteries have, are all um, Phantom 4 and Phantom 4 Pro batteries. As I said, the white ones are the Pro batteries, the gray ones are the Phantom 4 batteries. Um, the one point of observation is that the they are all they were all at about uh, fifty percent in terms of charge. So I've got one of them plugged into the original DJI charger, and so it's charging right now. I've got three of them plugged into the aftermarket charger, and I also have the um, remote plugged into the after the transmitter plugged into the aftermarket charger. It is three fifteen in the afternoon. So I will let you guys know how long it takes and if there is a big difference in time charging between the DJI charger and the aftermarket. One note about the aftermarket, it does have a fan and so it makes a little bit of noise if you listen. You can hear that sound, that's the fan on this thing. It kicks on when you plug them in. I'm sure it's just cooling uh, these things, but um, like I said, it is surge protection, it is overheat protection. Um, I've used this one a couple of times now already and it seems to do a great job. I haven't compared the times though to how long it takes to charge compared to the DJI um, charger, which by the way is, is absolutely silent. It's more of a solid state thing with no moving parts or no fan at least, but it won't charge three at once. So I got all four of them going at 3.15 in the afternoon. Let's wait and see how long it takes for them to charge. Be right back. Okay, so it ended up taking about 55 minutes to an hour for these guys to top off from uh, around 50%. And again, uh, just like with the Mavic aftermarket battery charger, it was about the same with the aftermarket battery charger as it was with the DJI original battery charger. So it seems like the charge rate is very similar between uh, the two. Um, Again, the aftermarket one has a bit of a fan in it, or it has a fan in it, so there's a bit of a hum when it's running, uh, but when it's not running, it is it is plugged in right now. Uh, this one doesn't have any lights or anything, so you have to rely on the lights within the batteries <clears throat> to tell you when they're charged, but about 55 minutes to top them off from 50%. Now this guy uh, took almost two hours to top off, and this was also at about 50%. So um, it must just be a slower charging process to charge the battery in the remote because that was also the case with the um, Mavic Pro. This is also the Pro Plus which has the screen built in so I don't know if it has a different battery in order to support the screen but regardless um, it took it about two hours to top it off at 100% uh, from 50. So overall again big fan of these aftermarket um, chargers they're fairly inexpensive, they are reliable, if you don't mind a little bit of fan noise. They're well made, made of metal, um, very solid rubber connections, uh, good gauge wire, and do the job really well for multiple batteries. So if you're interested in one of these, uh, 
I'll leave a link so you can check it out. I'm also going to leave a link to the other video with the uh, um, Mavic Pro charger, if you have a Mavic Pro. Um, it definitely allows you to fly more frequently because you don't have to wait quite as long to have your batteries charged, and I think it's well worth it. So thanks for watching. If you like this, hit the thumbs up button, and if you really like it, hit the subscribe button, and we'll see you next time on Ready, Set, Drone.